Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Petrocco in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link. We made it to Friday. We've got a gorgeous sunset looking at uh, New Bedford right now as of about the th almost 3.30 in the afternoon. Nice day today. The sunshine, the uh, the lighter wind, and um, you know, seasonably cool temperatures looking at Easton's Beach and Newport. Of course, the sun getting lower and lower early. A sunset time at around oh, 4.15, 4.20. Uh, heading out your Friday evening, Friday night. Um, Weather looks fine. We don't have any precipitation yet, though we are under a pinpoint weather alert specifically for Saturday, specifically Saturday afternoon and early evening. So here's the breakdown. No problems this evening. Uh, Saturday morning, overall, especially early, is fine. It's a dry start, milder. We'll start to see the winds picking up, gusting to 25 to 35. But we'll bring in a period of rain and some stronger wind on Saturday afternoon and early evening. Now, Certainly high impact and, and worthy of a weather alert, but by no means is this anything severe or over the top. So with that said, more rain uh, in the afternoon, though the amounts not excessive, about a half inch of rain. And wind gusts out of the south are going to be somewhere between about 35 and 45 miles per hour, almost similar to the wind gusts we had with the storm a few nights ago. So there may be some isolated um, power outages, isolated tree limb damage. You want to secure your holiday decorations. I just don't see any... Uh, widespread damage or widespread outages in the tens of thousands, but some sporadic um, tree limb damage or outages possible in the afternoon and evening. So here's the setup. Uh, it's quiet across New England. Here's the wider view. And tracking area of low pressure in northern plains and attached to it is both a, a warm front and a cold front. So this is the warm front, and that'll be pushing through overnight into tomorrow. It's the reason why it'll be on seas. It'll be mild tomorrow 55 to 60 and then the cold front that blue line passing through um, later tomorrow afternoon tomorrow evening and out ahead of that some periods of rain this is a fast moving system so it's actually clearing out by later saturday night so let's take this into uh, the future here again we're looking good for tonight and you can see the leading edge of the rain now this is um seven o'clock in the morning it's still the rain is still to our west i would say the start time is between 11 a.m and one in the afternoon and then certainly during the afternoon, some rain and some wind. In fact, this is 12 noon. This is about 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So you're going doing some holiday shopping. By all means, go ahead, but grab a raincoat, an umbrella. Going to and from the store, it will be wet and windy, but at least it's, it's mild. It's in the upper 50s. Cold front coming through around 7, 8 o'clock in the evening will clear things out. In fact, by 8, 9, 10 o'clock, skies have cleared out and the, and the temperatures are dropping off. Uh, okay, well, here's a more detailed look at, uh, I don't know I had this map in here, but let's show it anyways. Uh, so this is 8 o'clock in the morning. It's quiet. Here's the leading edge of the rain at, uh, this is 11, about 11.30 in the morning. Widespread rain, heavy at times, 2 in the afternoon, windy, uh, mild in the upper 50s. And then towards the early evening, the precipitation is more sporadic and scattered, but at least the risk of a few more showers, 7, 8 o'clock in the evening. But watch what happens beyond 8 o'clock. It clears out rapidly, and it turns a lot cooler. All right, so for tonight, looking good. Maybe heading out, getting the Christmas tree. Uh, weather looks fine. Uh, temperatures in the uh, mid-30s. What will happen, actually, after midnight towards daybreak, the temperature will actually rise rather than fall. So while it'll be cool tonight, it won't be as chilly as last night. This is... Uh, Saturday morning, we're running about only a 10% chance of showers at 7 a.m. But notice the precipitation chances ramp up to 50% by 11 a.m. with increasing uh, rain, or increasing chances of showers and wind. And then, you know, nearly a, um, whoa, look at that. How's that for a typo? <laughs> All right, my bad. I was rushing, but you can clear <laughs> uh, the precipitation chances. Uh, they're not zero. They're running um, at least 100%. So, ignore those numbers on the bottom. But the temperatures are correct. I got that right. Upper upper 50s to low 60s. Widespread uh, rain and winds. A little caution traveling uh, as temperatures will be on seas will be mild. Uh, boaters, no surprise here. Gale warning in effect. Uh, southerly winds, uh, 30 to gust of 40, 45 knots. Improving weather Saturday night. Good news. Your Sunday looks nice. The sun is back, but it is cooler. All right, that's your latest Weather Now update. Thanks for logging in. We'll talk to you soon.